Hello guys, welcome back. My name is Muhammad Ali and in this video lecture we are going to complete this app and test the app. So as you know that uh, till now I mean we have loaded the model, we have added and loaded the model into our this flutter project as well as we have run the model on our stream frames from camera. Now the next thing is just to display the results on the user interface on the home page. So for that we have to simply come down here to our widget build and after the stack widget we are going to add a center widget and then we can say child container margin edge insets dot only and from the top it will be 55.0 and we can say child single child scroll view child text and the background color for this is to four let's display the results and then after it we have to apply some style on it text style so first of all the background color for this will be colors dot black 87 comma the font size will be 30.0 and the color will be white colors dot white and let's align the text at center so we can say text align text align dot center so now before testing the app one thing which we forgot is basically the path when we load the model we forgot to add that is it is inside the assets folder okay so make sure to first add the assets and inside the assets folder slash and then this file name same is for the label file it is inside the assets folder slash asset slash and then the label file name also so yeah that's it now let's just test the app to see if it is working or not in this course you will learn how to make your own deep learning and machine learning android and ios application using flutter with tensorflow lite you will learn how to make your own object deduction app live object deduction app with your phone camera you will learn how to make your own face deductor or face recognition app with live camera for example if there are hundreds of faces uh, in front of you let's say in front of you there are hundreds of people then the app will simply deduct all the faces you will also learn how to make a cat deductor app cat breeds deductor app using which i mean you can identify between different cat breeds for example if the cat is ragdoll epsian or if it is persian or many other cat breeds You will also learn how to make your own image captions predictions app which simply means that you will simply turn on your live camera and it will tell you all the things that is going on in this live stream for example here you can see on the screen a person is typing on a screen so it says that an open laptop sitting on the top of a screen and you can see the prediction changing at real time which now say a person using a laptop computer on a desk and here you can see I am sitting on a desk so that is really cool here you can see it 
Now, if I move camera to word, computer, mouse and keyboard, it's a, a close up of a keyboard and a mouse and you can see the other two predictions also. So it will basically predict the captions according to the live camera view, I mean the camera, what is going on in the background. The next app that we will develop is basically the Avenger Characters Recognizer app which will simply identify or you can say recognizer all the characters you can say the actresses and actors in Avengers here you can see Thanos and then if we select another picture here you can see Black Widow you can also capture image with your phone camera for example here if I capture this picture Then here you can see it says Captain America. The next app that we will develop is basically the Flowers Types Recognizer app, which will recognize different flower types. For example, this one is Tulip Flower. If we select another picture, for example, this one is Candy Line. And if you can also capture any image with your phone camera, for example, I'm going to capture a picture here. And here you can see the next app is the post estimation app which will basically recognize the different poses for example your left eye right eye your left shoulder right shoulder your left hip your right hip here you can see The next app is the image to text converter app which simply means you can capture any image with your phone camera that contains no matter if there are human beings in it or anything but if that image contains any text then it will basically extract that text from the image and it will display to you that is this text here you can see it uh, on your screen for example if I capture this image So here you can see it. You can also select any image from your gallery and it will display the results. You will learn how to make cat and dog identifier app, cat and dog classifier app in which basically you will uh, capture image with your phone camera or you can also select image from the gallery and it will basically tell you that is this is a dog or this is a cat here you can see the example on your screen The next app that we have is basically the fruit fruits deductor app which simply means in a you will simply point your phone camera toward any fruit live okay with a live camera and it will tell you here you can see it will predict the fruit's name for example the first prediction it made is grabs and then the other one you can also see the first prediction about this one is bananas You will also learn how to make your own dog's breed identifier app which will simply identify any dog's breed. For example here you can see this one is German Shepherd. Then here you can see a one hound with live camera ok this is the live stream here you can see the names if I change the image here you can see American Fox Hound. And many other apps that we will develop in this course we will develop 15 plus apps 15 plus apps in this course so see you guys in the course so the app is running now here you can see it so the app is running now and now let's just click on this icon in order to open up the live camera 
you can see it is deducting desk and then chair desk bottle pop bottle monitor desktop computer if i zoom it further then here you can see pop bottle and then if i zoom it here monitor or laptop okay see so yeah, it is working fine that is really cool and really nice vas port you can see it is deducting microphone so yeah, that's it for this app